Hello and welcome to a random haul video by Sammy B. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> the tree's poking me. Let's get right into it. Random haul. This was hard to say for the video, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, we got bulk pickle vodka. Uh, I'll say it once, I'll say it infinity times. I am the Caesar queen. And uh, gotta go bulk with this pickle vodka. Such a good deal. So I don't know if y'all ever tried that. I got these Pompe Mimosas strawberry grapefruit. And they are incredible. They're so good. Next, I got Okanagan white grape. I haven't tried this flavor and it was amazing. Ooh, I got Summer Z, Summer's B. Uh, red rhubarb cider. Never tried it. And this is so exciting. Um, Smirnoff Ice Berry Blast. Citrus, blue raspberry, and cherry. Limited edition. And it looks like one of those rocket popsicles. So I am honestly so stoked to try these. I've been waiting to make this video. I just, oh, it's been like two weeks since I've had these. Now I can finally try them. So, that's it. Oh, I'm just joking. <laughs> a palette. This is my first real... Yeah, it was my first time I ever bought a palette or anything. I always see the Jeffree Star ones. They look amazing. But um, I'll save that for another time. This right now, it caught my eye. I had to have it. It's called Fetish by Kat Von D, which I don't really know who that is. I've just heard that name before. Um, it's... Fetish Blush Highlighter Palette, and um, the names of the shades are on the back, so you guys can read them if you want. And that's what the front looks like. So there's that, and I love the font because I've been watching Merlin. Um, it's like a movie or show about King Arthur, and the font is like kind of like Merlin, and it's kind of cool because the uh, the names are kind of like that as well magic telepathy you know like it's kind of cool uh, kind of goes with what i'm my theme of my life right now so here's what the palette looks like and i will most certainly do a review for you guys if you would like again names are on the back and then you open it up and the mirror the camera will not do this justice i swear You're like, that looks terrible. You're welcome. Yeah. I bought another branding thing. The Smashbox Original Photo Finish Smooth and Blur Primer. So that's what that looks like. I always see people use these long lasting makeup setting sprays. And Urban Decay already has been a gemstone to me. So I'm going to try this oil-free, paraben-free, temperature-controlled technology face setting spray. And we'll see if it lasts all night. I got another primer potion because I noticed that mine's kind of running out and I don't know when I was going to be back in Sephora. I got the eyeshadow primer potion in anti-aging because I'm getting out there in age. Sunnies. I got myself a flathead or flat screwdriver. Because I had a really special one in my car and um, some asshole fucking stole it. So, and I can't fucking get my hubcaps off without something like this. So, I bought this to replace it. How fucking a shame. What a shame. So disappointing. I hate when people steal like this. Such a. <sighs> Don't even get me started. Next. I got a few wallflowers. They're already around the house plugged in. I don't remember what scents they were. Um, but I do have an extra one here and it's called Incense. And you're probably like, oh, but this smells disgusting. It smells amazing. And I got Frosted Cake Pop. I got a Frosted Cranberry Wallflower as well. So with my Sephora purchase, I got a free sample of the Smashbox Studio Skin 15 Hour Wear Foundation. And I tried it. <laughs> 
but I thought there's gonna be enough to do my whole face. There wasn't. So I just kind of like rubbed it in my cheeks a little and like where I put it. And then I just used like my regular foundation. Um, so I don't really know what it's like. It's like, yeah, it just, it was kind of pointless to be quite honest. It was pretty much like enough to do a swatch on your hand and be like, oh yes, that looks good. From the swatch on my cheek, it looked fine. So yeah, no, I'm not complaining I got a free sample, but it was like, it wasn't enough to do anything. And it was like almost too much to just do like a swatch. So I don't know, it seemed a little pointless to me. Lemon pound cake tea. And you're, and yeah, it, it, I guess that was in my other video I filmed today. I'm drinking this one today. This is my first time trying it. It smells incredible. It tastes, yeah, it tastes really good. I was gonna say taste, that's not the right word. Oh, yes it is. It's an oolong tea, and it says, this buttery citrus oolong tastes just like a sweet slice of lemon pound cake. I don't know what lemon pound cake is, but it sounded good. I don't even like cake. Ugh, I only like ice cream cake. So I got that. They always say this is the sample pack, but there's so much tea, like I never even get through them. But I'm trying really hard not to buy too much stuff because, you know, life is hard. <laughs> With my David's tea, I got a free sample that actually hasn't come out yet. Maybe it has since this video has been posted. But it is the Organic Choco Choco Changa Detox. I don't know if I pronounced that right. This is what it looks like. And I tried it already, but I saved the pack and it is incredible as you watch my chin talk. That is what I got from my random haul video. Booze and makeup and tea and wallflowers. It is a lot of random stuff. That's why it's called a random haul video. And I saved it all to show you guys the heartburn. Okay, so anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you didn't, 